Following Tiger Woods' car crash yesterday, many are wondering how serious his injuries are and if he will ever get back on the golf course. Well, I sat down with two orthopedic surgeons in Vermont to learn the extent of his injuries. Golf star Tiger Woods is recovering in a California hospital following a serious crash in his SUV Tuesday. Woods suffered multiple open fractures to his legs, leading to a long surgical procedure. The tibia and the fibula are the two primary bones of your lower leg, so between your knee and your ankle. And uh, in this particular injury, he obviously had a crushing type mechanism by all reports where the bones break because something pushes on them very hard. Dr. Matthew Prohaska is an orthopedic surgeon in St. Johnsbury. He says a big concern for injuries like Woods is their high risk for infections. Both doctors I spoke with pointed to quarterback Alex Smith, who suffered a very similar injury in 2018. And I think he had 16 surgeries from infections and such before he got back, but he's actually went back and played. Um, but it's a serious injury. One Dr. Jesse Hahn has seen quite often in the OR at UVM Medical Center. He too is a surgeon specializing in orthopedics. With car accidents, especially in the wintertime, snowmobile accidents, something as simple as a slip and fall um, or accidents on the slope, um, especially in icy days, certainly. And then the summertime, you know, the highways, uh, um, definitely with motorcycle accidents car accidents and then also ATVs are often a big culprit. Both surgeons stress that recovery from something like this will be a long haul. They say Woods could face multiple surgeries down the road and will have to start with relearning the basics before even thinking about golf. The you know, rehab is really where the rubber meets the road. Just to be able to get strong again, get your balance back, you know, have, you know, have your gait return to normal, much less return to a high level of sport. We all hope that he does, and if anybody could do it, he probably could. He has the desire and the push to, to achieve that, but it's hard. It's going to take a lot of work and a lot of energy, and uh, so to get back to where he was, it's, it's going to be challenging. Courtney Kramer, Local 22 News.